Welcome to the Aquaspresso Coffee Academy and today we're going to be asking is the Jura coffee machine the best coffee machine out there? So there are a lot of good machines out there these days and all have quite a good reliability rating but why you would potentially want to choose, choose a Jura machine because they are more expensive than most of the other brands is because of four major technologies which they've launched over the years but predominantly in the last couple of years they've kind of taken it to another step. So we'll go through the four today. So number one is what they call the G3 grinder. So all coffee machines obviously have a, or at least all beans to cup coffee machines obviously have a grinder. And the finer you grind coffee, the more uh, flavor and the more you can extract that coffee and get all the goodness out of it. Now, why you would never really use like a pepper grinder to grind your coffee? Because they can never grind it fine enough. And while most coffee machines can grind it well, they don't grind it to the level that you would get a barista in a coffee shop grinding it. Now, Jura machines with the G3 grinder, which is fairly new, they only launched in about 2015, now have that ability to get that super, super fine grind to get that beautiful extraction out of the, out of the coffee. Second big development is what they call the intelligent pre-brew system. And the intelligent pre-brew system essentially wets the coffee before it actually presses the coffee out or before it essentially extracts the coffee out. And why that's important is when you wet the coffee, it essentially um, plumps up the coffee and fills the coffee and that allows the aroma to then escape um, which essentially gets the aroma out as opposed to just, ex just pressing the coffee out without any wetting at all. Um, so the intelligent pre-brew system essentially adjusts how much water gets added to that coffee depending on how much coffee there is um, which again is, is something quite unique to Jura. Third big, te big technology is often seen in the very very new Jura machines it's what they call pulse extraction. Now this has kind of got to do with the pre-brew system and when the coffee is wetted and a even pressure is, apply, is applied to that coffee or to the water on top of that coffee, you only get so much of that co those coffee grounds which actually get touched by the water. What a pulse extraction actually does is it shorts water through, uh, sh shoots water through that coffee in short bursts and then allows each of the coffee grounds to actually get wetted by the coffee and to allow that coffee which has now been ground to release all its aroma. Last big development is the fine foam froth. And what the fine foam froth essentially does, it creates a froth which is one of those what they call the super thick froths that you get again from a barista, which automatic machines up to now haven't been able to achieve. What automatic machines always in the past have been able to do is be able to create a froth-like substance, which has always got these big bubbles on top of the froth. With the new Jura frother, that farm foam frothing technology, there's now two chambers where the milk gets, uh, gets frothed into and then eliminates all the bubbles, which eventually comes out in a super fine, creamy texture when it eventually gets frothed out. Four big things that Jura have developed. Hope that helps and I hope that it makes your mind up whether it's worth it to go for Jura or not. Thanks so much.